What's up everybody? Alexandra here and as you can see I look a little bit crazy right now but that's okay because today my friends is Mask Monday. <laughs> No, but seriously, so I know a lot of you guys have been asking me what my full in-depth and detailed skincare routine is. So that is what we are doing today. I'm going to be going over everything that I do with you guys, both morning and night, each day of the week, the whole shebang, like no stone will be left unturned. All right. So before we get started, I do want to let you guys know that Yes Style did ask to partner and sponsor up with me on today's video. Now, what does that mean? Not really a lot because as I told you guys before, Yes Style is not a brand. They are not a product. They are simply an e-commerce. So they're like an online Ulta or online Sephora except for they sell a lot of the same K-Beauty products that they do at a highly discounted rate. And I mean, highly discounted rate. So if you guys so choose to shop at YesStyle, I do have a link and code that you can use down below to get, I think it's five or 10% off your order. Don't quote me, but I will put it down below in the description box. So now that we got all of the technicalities out of the way, let's go ahead and get into today's video because I'm excited about this one. Let's get things started with my nightly routine. Now I will tell you guys that I have my nightly routine that I use every single night of the week. And then I do add in extra steps on Mondays and Thursdays. So I'll tell you as we're going along, what is my nightly steps? And then what are my extra steps? Cause today's Monday, it's mass Monday. So the first thing I do on mass Monday is I do my hair mask, which I have right now on my head. And then I go ahead and I remove all of my makeup off of my face. I used to use the Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Remover, loved it. It was just really expensive. So I recently switched over to the Vanilla Clean It Zero. I did get this from YesStyle. I absolutely love it and it is half the price. As you guys can see, I use this every single night to remove my makeup. All right, so the next thing, and I feel like this is a very important step, is you need to exfoliate. Now, I only do this at night. I don't wash my face twice a day. I only do once and at night. And the reason being is because I have dry skin. Everybody is different. Everybody's routine is different. What your skin needs are different. This is just what works for me and my skin. So I really love having one of these things. Now, I did get a Clarisonic for Christmas. Uh, Steve got me this, but I'll be honest with you guys. I kind of like my $25 Duval better. I just need to get new heads for it because as you guys can see, I have literally used the crap out of this. So the first thing I do is I wet my face, which I have my little bowl here. Then I wet my brush and then I use a clean skincare face wash. So I was using the Drunk Elephant Jelly Face Wash, but I ran out of that. So I am now using the Ola Henriksen Truth Juice Daily Cleanser, which... I really like the way this smells. This is what came in my trend mood box. I turned my little scrubby thing on and I really do like the Clarisonic. I mean, it's nice. I just, it's like a little more harsh than what my Duvall was. Um, but I do like because it like kind of pulsates and tells you when to move to the next area. Like, I just want to show you guys, you see all the extra makeup. So I had already washed my face with the makeup remover, which gets a majority of it off. But this really gets down in your pores. Same, the Duvall did the same thing. The other thing is I don't use a washcloth. I actually use a baby towel to rinse and wash my face off with because it's just a lot softer material. So as you guys can see, I use one side to rinse the soap off of my face and then I use the other dry end to pat my face dry. And I will only use this two nights in a row. So I'll use this tonight, hang it up, and then I will use this tomorrow night one more time and then I will throw it in the laundry and grab a new one. And the reason being is because I don't want like mildew on my towels, inflammating the skin or, you know, making my face gross. You know what I'm saying? So I started doing Mass Mondays a couple of months ago and I cannot even stress to you guys how helpful this has been, not just for my skin, 
but for my mood and my mental state because everybody hates Mondays. So this kind of gives me something to look forward to do on Monday nights. Plus it really sets the tone and my mood for the rest of the week. You know what I'm saying? Like Monday is like the gateway for the week. So I do my hair mask, which is my homemade do it yourself hair mask. If you guys have not seen the video, I have all the ingredients and how to make it in that video. I will link it at the end of this one. And then I use a face mask and sometimes I'll even use a hand mask or a feet mask. So I did get these from Yes Al and I love them. And it's actually kind of what gave me the idea to start doing this on Monday nights because this is called the mask Monday pack. So I'm on my last one. This is, I think there's like seven in each pack. So this is the moisture pack and I'm a, I saved the best for last. So this is the Vita Light Beam Essential Mask. So this is the one we're gonna be using tonight. And then they also have the Trouble Pack, which this is what I'm using next. And I'll just like quickly show you guys what's in this one. So there's the Glan More, which kind of reminded me of like a knockoff, like Glam Glow kind of mask. Um, but it's a sebumless mud mask. There's a green Pearl Station Tea Tree Care Mask. I'm excited for that one. I'm really excited for this one. This is a bamboo smooth and refining mask. Then there's a Cicada Zinc Sheet Mask. And then the next one is an Innisfree BHA Clinic Skin Mask. So you guys know I love anything with BHA in it. So this will be really good. And then there's a Spot Saver Mugwort Gauze Mask. That one looks very interesting. And then I love the name of this one. It's called, I'm sorry for my skin. Like that is just, I love the name. All right. And then the other pack they have is a variety pack. So this has a little bit of everything. I love the cute little cactus on there. So again, this has a little bit of everything in it. So this one's like a um, banana and honey mask. And then just honey, a visible difference mask a vegan mask. Then there's a deep purifying black O2 bubble mask. So again, it's kind of like the Glam Glow bubble mask. This is a fresh red ginseng mask. I've heard really amazing things about ginseng on your skin. So I'm curious about that one. This one, I don't know about So this one is the Snail Bee High Content Mask Pack. So I don't know if it's like a snail dragon across your face. I don't know. I'm a little interested in it though. And then this one I thought was cool because it comes with the cleaner and the mask. So it's a refreshed two-step mask and it's a green clean uh, 11 village factory mask. So I kind of thought that was cool because you got the cleanser and then the mask. So it's like a two-step process. All right, so let's use the one that I'm gonna be using tonight, which is the Vita Light Beam Essential Mask X. It just looks very amazing. And we're gonna get my scissors. Oh, I didn't have to use scissors. Sometimes I have to use scissors to open it, sometimes I don't. All right, so I just pull my little mask out here, nice and gooey and covered in yumminess. Like not edible yumminess, but you know what I'm saying, like yumminess for your skin. So I just very carefully put this on my face without trying to eat any of it and sucking it up my nose. <laughs> and then if you have like a jade roller or something, then you use a jade roller to go over it. I don't have a jade roller. I used to have one, but my face was too bony and it like hurt my face. I'm sorry, I'm talking very funny. So um, I got this little head on my Clarisonic. So I've been using this instead. So it's got like a high vibration and then like a lower. So I click the lower one. There we go. And then I just kind of slowly move it around. It's just so relaxing. I mean, even if you had like a little vibrator or something, just whatever. Or like I said, one of those little jade rollers, just lay back and put your feet up, put a mask on your hair, put a mask on your face. love it so much and then like sometimes if there's extra stuff in here yeah there we go so I do those for about 10 minutes and then when I'm done I will get in the shower and wash everything on my face and on my hair off and I'm good to go
So because showers can be so drying due to all the heat and the steam and then walking out to the cool dry air, as soon as I get out, I moisturize my entire body and I also put on a moisturization or protectant on my lips. So this is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I already put some on, like I said, as soon as I get out and then I finish up the rest of my skincare routine. Now on the nights that I'm not doing the Monday or Thursday mask, I use first the AHA BHA 30 Days Miracle Toner. So I'll wash my face instead of doing the mask, I'll use this. And then on the nights that I use the mask, I skip that step and I go on to the AHA BHA PHA 30 Days Miracle Serum. So I got all three of these in a kit and I'm just gonna be honest, you guys, I have been loving them. Now, I used to use the Drunk Elephant at night after I got all the shower, and I would use that before I go to bed, but I haven't used it since I've gotten these products because I honestly, they've replaced it. They have the same AHA and BHA, and they also have PHA in them, which I truly love, and just I'm, they've just really made a difference. I just love, 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 love these products, and they're not nearly as expensive at all. So if you guys notice, I always bring my skincare routine down on my neck. Now, I really should be bringing it all the way down to my decollete area, but I haven't got there yet. I'm just bringing it down on my neck. So I first put that on, I let it soak in a little bit, and then I use the AHA, BHA, PHA, 30 Days Miracle Cream on over top of that. And I just use this on my face, not my lips and not under my eyes or around my eyes, because I've been using something else on my eye area, which I'm gonna show you guys in just a second. And the one thing I really do like about these products is a little bit goes a very, very long way. And I, again, have really noticed a difference since I started using them. Now, under and around my eyes, I have been using the SK2 RNA Power Radical New Age Cream. Now, I also got this from Yes Style, and I absolutely love it for the eye area. I, again, have just really noticed a difference um, since using this. And I know this stuff is expensive, but that's the one thing I like about Yes Style is I only, this was only $26 on their site, and it's just just try it. It's definitely $26 well spent and it's a lot better than trying it through Sephora or Ulta for like $235. No joke you guys. That's how much that stuff is there. All right and then I as I told you guys so that is what I do on Monday nights. I do the Monday night mask during the rest of the week instead of doing the mask I use the toner and then on Thursday nights I do not use this kit at all. I do not do the mask. Instead I do the TLC Sakari baby facial. So I just use the baby facial wash that off, get in the shower. And then when I get out, the only thing I put on my face after that is the uh, Virgin Marula Luxury Face Oil. Both of these are by Drunk Elephant. You cannot get these on Yes Style. They are, again, on Drunk Elephant. You can only get them at Sephora. So I have not found dupes for these products yet, sorry to say, but this is the only thing that I use. So I wash my face and then I use the mask. After I wash the mask off and I get out of the shower, I moisturize my body. I use the lip uh, sleeping mask on my lips and then the marule oil on the rest of my face. And I do that again as soon as I get out of the shower. So that is my full nightly routine, Monday through Friday. Um, so Mondays and Thursdays are my change up nights. The rest of the week, I just do face wash, these products right here, this, and this. That is my full routine right now. That is it, you guys, for at night. Morning, you guys. So it is time for me to go over my morning routine with you, which is actually super simple, and it does not change from day to day because, honestly, I don't have a lot of time in the mornings. Like, I'm getting Liam up and getting him ready and all of that stuff, getting him his bottle and breakfast and getting the kids off to school. So after everybody leaves for the day, this is what I do. So this is important. I have my little skincare fridge here. So I told you guys about this. This is my $20 Walmart special. I keep all of my morning products in here, all of my vitamin C goodies. So the first thing I use is my Andalou and I keep it in the box. I told you guys, anything vitamin C, keep in the fridge, keep it in the box, keep it in a cool, dark place. It um, 
really helps it keep its potency. So I just put some on my fingers. Oh my God. And it really wakes you up too. It really, really wakes you up because you got that cool, just vitamin C loveliness that you're just soaking in your skin. And, and when it's ice cold like that, it just really wakes you up. And then where it's so cold, it also really sucks your pores down and just really gets them get some in there. So as I told you guys, after you use this, because it is a serum, you want to use a moisturizer afterwards. And I've told you guys, I can never have enough vitamin C. So the next thing that I use is the Ola Henriksen Truth Sea Rush Brightening Double Cream Serum. Now this is kind of a new thing to my routine. I just added this in there. I used to use the Drunk Elephant Polypeptide Proteiny Cream or proteiny polypeptide cream, however you want to say it. But anyways, I used to use that, um, but I just got this, uh, both of these Ola Henriksen uh, products, the cleanser and that one in my trend mood box. I was really excited to try them out. They are new products. I have been loving them. I just feel like I'm getting like a big dose of vitamin C just first thing in the morning, every single day. And then if I am seeing like some wrinkles or, you know, just extra puffiness or something like that, then I will go in with a little bit, and I mean like a very, very, very tiny bit, and I have it in my little skincare drawer where I have all of my night routine things, but I will go in with a little bit of the Drunk Elephant A Passiony Retinol Cream, and I will just put a little tiny dab of it, and it's normally like on my smile lines maybe, or a little bit like on my forehead, but I'm looking pretty good today. So I don't really feel like I need it. Now, as I told you guys with the Andalou, again, it is a serum. So if you don't want your face sticky after you use it, because a lot of times serums will do that, make sure you go in with a really good moisturizer after. <sighs> I cannot have a video without dropping something. Okay, so I put this back in my skincare fridge, close it up, and I'm good to go to start the day. So I just let that soak in give it some time before I put any makeup or anything else on. So that is all my morning routine consists of. And again, this is the same routine Monday through Sunday. It has not changed. Now I do kind of change up the products as I receive products and try things out and find new loves or empty bottles, that kind of thing. But I'm really, really loving like the big dose of vitamin C in the morning. So I think I'm really going to try to stick to that. Even if I just stick to the Andalou and maybe put like a different moisturizer on or something, but I really like the big dose of vitamin C. I've really noticed a difference in like my little dark spots. I have a couple here and I had a couple here and they got pretty light using the Drunk Elephant. But then when I switched over to the K Beauty dupes, again, I told you guys in that video, like huge difference. Like it took me back over that plateau that I was on and just really made a very big difference in my routine. So I'm probably going to stick to that. I will also tell you guys that sometimes before I am applying my makeup, because sometimes I do go a while between my morning routine and my makeup routine, I will go in with a little extra dose of moisturization. If I'm feeling kind of dry with the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream, I really do like this, but this is like only if I'm really, really, really dry that day because this, <laughs> this will make you a little oily if you're not careful with it. I'm just going to be honest. So, and I didn't get a big jar. I just got a little jar because a little bit goes a long way. I mean, I've had this forever and like, you see how much I use out of it? Not much. I mean, seriously. So anyways, that is all I have for you guys today. I love you so, so very much. I hope you guys have a wonderful evening and rest of your week. And if you get a chance, definitely grab one of those mask packs. You guys make a mask Monday for for yourself. It is so totally worth it. So inexpensive. And again, I do it every week. So, you know, one of those packs lasts for seven weeks. You can't beat it. You know what I mean? And they're really just, I, again, I've noticed a huge difference in just not just my skincare routine, but my mood and just everything throughout the week. I just, it really makes a difference. All right. So again, that is all I have. Love you guys. Bye.